Alright guys, so I am here with a books I'm currently reading haul, or review. Um, so I'm not going to be doing to be reads because I get trapped up in those. Like I'll say, I'm going to be reading this in February or January, but I end up not reading like half those novels that I say that I'm going to read. So this is a great way to show you guys what I'm reading this month and um, just a great way in general to show you and do like mini review book review hauls. So, so let's go ahead and start with my phone. So on my phone I have um, the Overdrive app which is awesome. You can get it through your local library and then you can like get ebooks to your or audiobooks to your phone. So through the Overdrive app. You could also use it on Kindle but I just do it on my phone because I have my phone with me all the time. I don't have Kindle with me all the time and so when I'm in the car and I'm wanting to listen to an audiobook or something, I can just do it right here. So this one is um, Finding Audrey by Sophie Kinsella. I don't know if you can see that, but it's an audiobook. I'm about a third of the way in. It's really good. It's about social anxiety, um, and it just gives you good perspective on it. Um, she's British, too, so it's fun to listen to the audiobook because the, the reader is has an accent so I like that um, but yeah it's a really it's a really good tool and this book is actually really good so far so if you want to listen to it on audiobook make sure and check out overdrive that you can use with your local library okay um, the next books are these ones let's start with what's on my Kindle so I said I don't use my Kindle very much but I, I do have the Kindle app on my phone and that's where I'll read most of my Kindle books because it's easier. So right now I am reading Harry Potter, the third one. So that's Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban. This is my favorite Harry Potter book of all the books. <laughs> the third one is amazing. So, um, yeah. I love Harry Potter. If you, if you haven't read Harry Potter yet, I don't know what's happening. If you're not a reader, I understand. That's okay. You can watch, watch the movies because they're pretty awesome too. There's a lot of stuff that's missed in the movie though. That's why I love to read the books over again. And so I read um, Sorcerer's Stone in like the summer. And then I read Chamber of Secrets in I think it was October. And then I just am like halfway through. More than halfway through the third book. So that's what I'm reading right now on my Kindle. And then um, I am reading The Unbeatable Squirrel Girl. Marvel. So this is the first comic book that I've ever, ever read. I have a lot of graphic novels though. Um, I have Fablehaven and I have um, The Lumberjanes and then this one. Um, but I love Squirrel Girl. She's actually pretty awesome. I hope that they make a movie out of her. I don't know if they will, but she's pretty cool. So she's kind of like Ant-Man in the way that, she, um, you know how Ant-Man, I don't know if she's seen the movie or the comic, but Ant-Man can like control all the ants. Um, he can get on the same wavelength as them. Squirrel Girl, Squirrel Girl is like that. She can do that with the squirrels and um, it's just fun. It just talks about her going to college for the first time and I like this graphic novel a lot. Um, it's pretty easy to read. Um, you know, she's meeting this guy, she's moving in, and she's got all these boxes because she's strong. Um, so yeah, it's just fun because she's awkward and, I don't know, quirky, you can relate to her, but then she's also fighting, fighting superheroes, so it's a great book. And then the last book that I am currently reading is Rook. I talked about this in my last video, so if you want to hear a little bit more about it, go check that one out. But this is an awesome YA novel. I've been loving it so far. Um... It's really good. And, um, you know, I talked about in that video how the cover drew me in. And now that I'm into the book, everything on the cover has meaning. Like, the fact that this is red and the feathers, like, they all have meaning. So, I love when, I love when books do that. And throughout this book, let me see if I can show you. Here's one. Throughout this book, like, at the beginning of each chapter has this beautiful heading of the feathers because the feathers do pay, play an important role in the book so I love that when books do that and then the dust cover jacket it's just beautiful and yeah I just I really like this book so if you are needing something new to read um definitely check this out 
Alright, so that is what I'm currently reading for December. Stay tuned for to find out what I'm currently reading in January. So my goal for 2018 is to read three books a month. Um, I probably will surpass that goal most of the time, but I tend to set it small because if life gets busy, um, then, you know, I want to have the flexibility to go along with life and, and not have to worry about reading books. So yeah, I have three books that I want to read every month. I'm really excited to um, continue sharing these videos with you. I think my next video is going to be a haul video, so stay tuned for that. Um, it's just going to be a haul from November, December, and then I'm probably going to do a book review after that. So, thanks so much for watching. Again, please subscribe, and I will talk to y'all later. Have a great day. Bye.